Pennsylvania's John Fetterman has been trolling the hell out of New Jersey native Mehmet Oss, whose uh, campaign is getting just absolutely obliterated. Not only is Fetterman polling better in the race and pulling in more money due to having more popular policies, progressive policies, uh, but also because of the hilarious trolling. I, I mean, you can't look and and and... You can't deny that Fetterman is absolutely winning the messaging wars. Now, the Fetterman campaign, uh, as an example here, recently hired Snooki of Jersey Shore uh, to, you know, do a cameo to tell Dr. Oz that he should just come back to New Jersey. New Jersey is so fantastic, so great. You should come back. Well, why would anybody want to leave Jersey? Well, I guess if you're Oz and wanted to win a, a Senate seat. <laughs> Uh, now, that's not the only one. Of course, uh, Fetterman also released a new video. Here it is. We all know that Dr. Oz is so proud of being Jersey strong. Well, I'm from New Jersey. He's a huge New Jersey celebrity who's lived there for three decades. Clearly, he loves his home state. He's even registered to vote there. To honor Dr. Oz's deep New Jersey roots, we thought it'd be a great idea to start a petition and help him reach his dream of being inducted into the New Jersey Hall of Fame. Help us recognize his Jersey pride by signing our petition today. <laughs> nice. Well done. Well done. Hey, uh, other Democrats, are you paying attention? This is how you run a campaign. You, uh, you're supposed to savage your opponents. You're supposed to find a weakness and hammer the crap out of them. That's what Fetterman's doing. You're supposed to do that instead of coward. Uh, and you're supposed to, by the way, turn attacks against you around on your opponent. And let me show you another good example here of Fetterman doing just that. So now Dr. Oz's team, he thinks he, thinks he can meme, okay? The, for one, hilarious, Dr. Oz thinks that he can meme. He thinks he can out-meme Fetterman. In fact, here's what he put out. Lost, John Fetterman. Either he's hiding or in his basement or just he's, or he's just plain lost. Hmm, yes. Oh, uh, mm. You know what's funny is that that actually kind of looks badass. I mean, look at that. I mean, just look at the way he's like towering over the landscape. That does not look lost to you. Uh, and so what's great about this is uh, Fetterman took a look at that and they went, hmm, kind of like it. I think I'll take it. Yoink. <laughs> oh, look. <laughs> Fetterman's going to have to start paying Oz's team for pretty much campaigning on his behalf. That's what they're doing. <laughs> like all the memes about like, oh, he's so close to Bernie Sanders. That's also helping Fetterman because Bernie Sanders is the most popular politician in the country. <laughs> okay. Hey, uh, good luck with that. Yeah, Keep campaigning on behalf of John Fetterman, Dr. Oz. Well done. And by the way, speaking of that, uh, the Bernie Sanders stuff. Um, I have one more put out by, uh, Dr. Oz and his team and a response by Fetterman. Take a look. Best friends with Bernie. While running in Senator in 2016, uh, Fetterman endorsed another candidate running against party establishment, Bernie Sanders. Again, based. Awesome. I love it. To which, uh, Fetterman responds, graphic design is my passion. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's so good. It's so good to see someone actually running a campaign. Uh, like a real campaign. Look, uh, Dr. Oz, he is not, like, he's not even running as, like, a real person. Okay, he's like, he's trying so, so hard to troll and just getting absolutely owned. And you know why? It's because Dr. Oz, you think he memes? 
No, he's an out-of-touch celebrity doctor. And going against somebody who, you know, it, look, Fetterman is a real person. And he's running on good policy. And is actually just a normal, good human being. Decent person. That's why I'm pretty sure Dr. Oz gonna get blown out. 